Okay, so I just woke up from sleep. I don't know if you guys are visible on my face, but I basically just woke up from an attempt to try to get through the Blue Beetle movie. And the first thing I can say is everyone at DC and Warner Brothers requires deliverance. Everybody at DC and Warner Brothers requires a lengthy session of deliverance. This has to this might just I've been seeing a lot of movies might be comfortably top five for my worst movies of the year, but Blue B2 has completely blown that out of the water. Every movie that I said top five worst movies of the apologies to you, please. Blue B2 has completely taken like he has taken over the entire like he has taken over one, two, three, four, he has taken over the entire rankings for worst movie of the year. Barely a two-hour movie, I'm barely one hour in, and I'm just I'm just sleeping. I can't I can't even get into the car like the characters feel like they feel like people that should be more at place at iCali or something. There is a, there is no atom of seriousness in this movie. Character no, the plot was so fucking empty. How can a Young Justice an animation series do better than bringing Jaime Reyes's character to life with more depth and more panache than DC with all the budget in a live action movie. Maybe it feels wrong to dump on the movie like this after all they spent so much time and money and whatever but you did not you were not the one sitting here with me with just barely one hour ago with some of the worst experience of my life. I'm not even through with the movie and I'm already dropping a review that's how bad it is. The plot was a total, like, total, total rubbish. The characters, they, they do not fit into this movie at all. What kind of happy-go-lucky, everybody smiling, family-friendly, what kind of movie is this? Like, I am appalled. Like, this can't, like, this, this, scene, I say it again, everybody at DC and Warner Brothers needs deliverance. Jaime Reyes is diff like they are now trying to bring one kind of family friendly story that is Jaime Reyes is all about his family and whatnot. This is not Blue Beetle, like this is not Blue Beetle. This is bullshit. This is like this is not like fight choreography, CGI, everything was looking like something out of Nickelodeon channel. This is look like Spy Kids or something on steroids. This look like Spy Kids on, this is like iCarly on steroids, like what the fuck is this? As soon as the movie started, barely five minutes in, I was just shaking my head because I knew that there was no way, there was absolutely no way this movie was going to make sense. I saw it online yesterday night and I'm thinking, this one that Blue Beetle came out this early because normally studios like to milk the cinema run and all that, but lo and behold, I saw it. Available for download, 798 MB. Wasted over two hours because of the fucking shitty network. Trying to get Blue B2. Put it barely. I came back from, from early morning job. Put it around 10. And I'm fucking sleeping. Barely 30 minutes into the movie, I am sleeping. Like, I've been saying the worst movie of the year. This like is comfortably number one. I'm still going to go back and finish the movie, but from what I've seen, I think I'll be I'll be skipping like it's fast forward mode I'll be in right now. Like there is no way I'm watching this movie on a on a relaxed stand. <laughs> I can't I can't even recommend this movie to anyone. If you are seeing it, go and see it at your own peril, at your own risk. If you like it then maybe it's for you but as for me i cannot recommend i cannot recommend this movie to anyone that's the episode with the bootleg god on the bootleg corner movie reviews movie recommendation general field commentary get to the youtube subscribe leave a like comment if you want i'll be back again